Andrea Tantaros, a former Fox News host, charged in a lawsuit filed Monday that top executives at the network, including the man who replaced Roger Isles, punished her for complaining about sexual harassment by Mr. Isles. The suit by M.S. Tantaros, filed in New York State Supreme Court in Manhattan, is the latest round in a contentious volley that began in late winter when Fox claimed she had breached her employment contract by writing a book without receiving network approval. Fox News masquerades as a defender of traditional family values, but behind the scenes, it operates like a sex-fueled, playboy mansion-like cult, steeped in intimidation, indecency and misogyny MS, Tantara's suit says. Fox News said it would not comment on pending litigation. Mr. Isles, the network's founding chairman and guiding force for two decades, resigned last month after a former anchor, Gretchen Carlson, said in a suit that she was fired for refusing his sexual advances. Mr. Isles has denied all allegations of harassment. In April, the chief lawyer for Fox charged that M.S. Tantaros had concocted sexual harassment claims to gain leverage in the contract dispute. Her lawyer, Judd Burstein, said the book dispute was a pretext that Fox was using to silence her. During arbitration, Mr. Burstein said, Fox News offered to pay her a sum in the seven figures if she renounced claims against Mr. Isles and others at the network, including the host Bill Arley. According to the lawsuit, M.S. Tantaro said she had been subjected to unwelcome advances from Mr. O'Arley, whom she had regarded as a friend and advisor. Isles did not act alone, the lawsuit states, he may have been the primary culprit, but his actions were condoned by his most senior lieutenants, who engaged in a concerted effort to silence Tantaros by threats, humiliation and retaliation.